Hello and welcome to History Pod, the daily On This Day in History podcast. If you would like to join my other valued supporters who help to keep the daily episodes like this one being researched, recorded and released, you can find details on my Patreon at patreon.com forward slash history pod. Alternatively, Please leave a rating or a review on iTunes or Stitcher, or click to like the HistoryPod Facebook page. On the 22nd of September 1888, the first edition of the National Geographic magazine was published by the National Geographic Society. The National Geographic Society was established in Washington, D.C. in January 1888, Founded by just 33 men, the Society's first president was the lawyer and financier Gardner Green Hubbard, whose lay interest in science and geography perfectly embodied the Society's creation for the increase and diffusion of geographical knowledge. Nine months after the Society's foundation, the first edition of its journal was sent to its 165 charter members. Consisting mostly of short technical articles, the magazine struggled to increase its readership for the first few years of its existence. Following the election of Alexander Graham Bell as president and the appointment of a new editor, Gilbert H. Grosvenor, the early 1900s saw the magazine begin to focus more on pictorial content. Although criticised by some members of the Board of Managers for being too unscientific, the increasing use of often pioneering photographs soon helped to secure a much wider audience for the magazine. Although initially only available to members of the National Geographic Society, the magazine is now available to purchase on newsstands and through direct subscription around the world. The creation of nearly 40 different local language editions has resulted in a global circulation of more than 6.5 million copies per month, reaching an estimated 60 million readers. Revenue from sales of the magazine goes to help fund scientific expeditions and scientific research, as well as to sponsor travelling exhibitions making the National Geographic Society one of the largest non-profit scientific and educational organisations in the world. 